Welcome guys again in this new lecture series of data analytics using Altrix. In previous lecture we saw how to import and read Excel file using input data tool. Now in this lecture we are going to see how to select certain columns, how to rename certain columns. Suppose there are there is one column ID you can see here and I don't want this ID column in my further data analytics process and there are names of the columns which are very big I want to change the names of the column or I want to change the data type of the column so how to do that so let's see there is one tool here which is called select tool so again I can select and drag it here so it is if very near to the previous tool then automatically it will get connected like this then I can drag it anywhere onto the canvas okay so this is select tool what this select tool do so if you see here there are certain options written here like ID sepal length these are the column names and check boxes are there so I can uncheck this suppose I don't want this ID column in my further data analytics processing so I can click on this and uncheck this box now this will be not carrying forward to the next tool similarly any column which you don't want just uncheck it the second thing is type so there are types written here and if you want to change the type then there are options here bool is boolean and it is the smallest data type in Altrix then you have byte int 16 int 32 int 64 then we have fixed decimal float double and all these things then we have the size but automatically if you if I change something suppose this double I want to change this to float then size will automatically get changed if I want to rename this column okay if I want to rename suppose this is sepal length centimeter and I want to rename it to sepal length only then I can just rename it like this okay if I want to give some description about the column some information in short then I can do this also and then I have to run this okay now I have run this but you can see ID is written here so again you have to remember this this is the output anchor I haven't clicked on this anchor this is input anchor this is input anchor when I click on this output anchor then I can see the name of the column has been changed and ID column is removed so this is how you can remove any column and you can change the name you can change the type you can rename something you can add description you can change the data size also so this is the use of select tool again remember these things what these tools are doing because in Altrix examination these things are only asked okay so in this lecture we learn what is the purpose of select tool and how important it is in my data analytics process that's it for this lecture and we'll meet in the next lecture thank you